It was first team all ACC. Oh, um, well, I um, actually got a call from Coach Steve first. Uh, he congratulated me. I didn't know because um, I was in the bed sleep. So, um, you know, it's a, it was it was surprising to me, honestly. What do you think it says about not only your year, but the year that this team has had? Oh, it says a lot. I mean, you know, we, we, we worked hard, you know, ever since day one. You know, our Italy trip, it was beneficial to us. And, um, you know, it helped us out a lot. And, um, I feel like that, that hard work is paid off for it. You said you were surprised, but why were you surprised? Uh, I mean, I saw a lot of tweets saying uh, if KJ McDaniels isn't first team all ACC, something's wrong. And I, I was, I was, um, you know, I wasn't really too worried, but I was, I was surprised. I made first um, ACC with those caliber players, and um, it's just, it's, it's an honor. Is that a? I'm assuming it's a testament to how hard you worked. I mean, we all saw you as a, as a freshman, as a sophomore, and I mean, there's got to be some satisfaction. Oh yeah, so, um, you know, I'm definitely you know proud of myself, you know, and um, you know I have more work to do, you know, I, you know, never satisfied. So I just have to keep working and keep pushing. Did uh, Phil tell you that you were only the 12th player ever out of Clemson to be named? Uh, I did not know that. I did yeah. not know that. Uh, that's um, that's a great. That's great. Talk about this uh, th this week coming up. Obviously, you don't know exactly who you're going to play. Mm -hmm. Have a little bit of an, of an idea. Mm -hmm. um, how's this team's mindset? You know, considering what happened last Saturday. Well, uh, just hungry. I mean, because we, we felt like we should have won. You know, last Saturday, and um, you know we, we're going to go out there with the right mentality and go out there and fight and try to get as many wins as we can. How helpful is it that you guys have been successful against Boston College, been successful against Georgia Tech uh, already this season? It's helpful, but we, um, you know, you can't. You know, put your guard down because you know they've gotten better ever since we played them. Um, we watched them play, and you know they're they're getting better just just like we are. So we have to go out there and you know play play just as hard as they are. Is it they this, they have all these mock drafts coming out and have you as high as 17 now? Mm -hmm. Is it hard to keep focused with all of that kind of outside noise going on? It's not hard. I mean, I just ignore it for right now. I mean, I'm I'm doing what I need to do uh, for my teammates and you know go as far and you know do the best we can here at Clemson. Knowing how Coach Brownell and what he wants to do uh, at, uh, schematically to be named all ACC defense, that's got to be a pretty good 102 considering, you know, if you're not going to play, if you can't play defense for Coach Brownell. Oh, yeah, it's, it's, um, it's a great feeling because, you know, we um, we stand by our defense and, you know, that's what we that's what we um, go by first and that's what helps us win, I believe. Okay, Jay, just one final question. With that, I mean, if you had some, some assurances, yeah, I would be in the top 17 or 20 picks, would that make the decision easier? Um, I'm pretty sure it would. I mean, I just have to discuss it over with my family first and make sure that's the right right decision for us and for me. Yeah. And one last, I mean, one last one, just, you know, how does